sugar, 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 spice, 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 spice. And everything else. Nice. 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 These were the ingredients to make the perfect little drink. The wax rice at the end. Extra ingredients. Chemical X. Okay, yeah, so what this villager can do, really, is he can fly, because he's got superpowers, obviously, and, yeah, so he just flies around, and if I just place down a zombie, it will get transformed into a different zombie, so as you can see, and he'll shoot it with lasers. Oh, they went out of range there, so let's just go, oh, whoops, <laughs> okay, so let's just do that again. There we go. Come on. There we go. Let's try again. You know what? Let's just... And he also can kill big... Like, if a whole bunch of zombies are together, he can kill a big horde of them. So, let's just get a whole bunch, like so. And... If they're together, then... Come on. Liz? Yeah. Okay, so, yeah, that's basically <clears throat> that. Now, I'm not going to show you how the zombie works, how um, he'll turn into that. But, um, all I'm going to show you is this side of the command blocks and also these two here. So, as you can probably see, what these four do, they will detect for um, the four items that are there. So, um, it's just testing for Ati Tapio's item at um, this location within a radius of zero. And then the item ID is Minecraft Sugar. Now it's exactly the same location, but this time it's Minecraft Die Damage 3, which is Cocoa Beans. Damage 3S, make sure you have the S if it's some um, different types of items in that type of item stuff, whatever. And this is the same, I was just trying something there, you don't need that C equals negative 3. And this one's just Minecraft cake, and then this one is got a bit more to it, it's the same there, I also tried something there. <laughs> um, it's Minecraft Persian damage 16428S, and now if you, you need to add the tag, and then um, open close curly brackets, inside there you want display, open close curly brackets, and then the name is chemical X. So yeah, that's that. When all of them are activated, which is when all of them are in that hole there, it will turn on this torch, which will activate three commands. The first one will summon a guardian um, at this location, so it's a tiny bit above the location where you put the items. And the guardian is going to be silent, and the custom name is going to be laser. Then it's going to be riding a villager, okay, and then the villager is going to be riding a bat with the custom name of flying, and it's going to be silent. Then one tick later after that, we'll just play a, um, execute um, at the villager's uh, location, and we'll just um, put a particle, huge explosion at the villager's location with um, that radius and uh, speed 100 and count 1. And then this one is will also um, execute the villager at its location, but it will kill um, all entities within a radius of five around him. So, yeah. Then these three command blocks here will give laser um, invisibility forever. True. Now, when you summon them with invisibility, you can see the bubbles, but if you do it with a command block, you can actually specify the true. The next one um, here will just... Oh, wait, that's for the zombie. Um, the zombies. They've got a squid on their head that's called bait, and I'll just make it invisible here. And then this one will make flying invisible. That's the bat under him. So the bat under him and the guardian on top of his head will be invisible. So, 
Uh, now these two command blocks. Um, I've made a scoreboard objective called item. And this will go scoreboard players add at e type equals item. And I'll, um, give the, I'll make the item one. Or we'll add one. So I'll go one, two, three, four, five. And it'll go up to 20 every second. So it'll go 20, 40, 60, 80 every second. But only on all the items that is um, Minecraft die, um, damage zero. Now you have to add damage zero because if you just keep it Minecraft die, then it'll add it item one to all dies. So damage zero is the, actually the squid, um, the ink sack that the squid drops. And I need that because it's gonna, this one's gonna execute at, at E, type equals item, who's got a score item minimum of one, and then I'll kill at E, type equals not player, within a radius of two. So, what that does is, when the villager kills the zombie, um, well, when the, Guardian kills the squid on top of the zombie's head. Um, it will drop an ink sack, and then that ink sack will kill all entities within a radius of two, which will kill the zombie and also kill itself.